Well, we all learned today the New Era Cap Company is announcing plans to close its factory in Derby, bringing to an end a half a century of operation there for this Buffalo-born company. Good evening once again. I'm Scott Levin. And I'm Mary Alice Demler. The company plans to stop operations there in March. And Channel 2's Dave McKinley is live just outside the plant on Route 5 with more about this news, which will result in the loss of hundreds of jobs in western New York. Right, Dave? The company says owning this manufacturing plant is no longer viable for it in today's global economy. And word of its shutdown caught many by surprise, including the county executive and, of course, the workers here who were informed this morning of this end of an era at New Era. In an average year, New Era was making about 2 million caps in this Derby plant, which has been on operation since the 1960s. They include the ones worn by Major League Baseball players on the field. But that's only a fraction of the 65 million caps they produce on an annual basis at plants which they do not own, but contract through around the world to make their products. The advantage there is you can make a lot more hats, and there are no employees to directly pay. But the Derby plant was the only one making caps which the company owned and operated. In a statement, the company's CEO said even as other sports apparel brands moved away from running their own manufacturing plants, we continued making caps at our facility in Derby. But I have an obligation to our employees, partners and customers to ensure the long term success of this company. And we need to keep pace with the changes in our industry. This is, you know, particularly disappointing in that it's a Buffalo started and rooted uh, company. But, you know, we're still very proud of the, the headquarters that here it a lot of visitors. New Era employs more than 300 workers at its downtown Buffalo headquarters, which the company says will not be affected by the plant shutdown. New Era also supplies caps for the NFL and NBA, but its deal to provide caps worn on the field by Major League Baseball players, and which runs through 2030, stipulates that they be made in America. To conform to that, the company will now make those caps and just those caps at its subsidiary firm, Fifth and Ocean Clothing Company, at this facility outside of Miami, which New Era acquired in 2009, leaving more than 200 Western New York employees out of work. These uh, technically trained folks are probably going to be in demand by other employers in the region, and and uh, we will certainly make use of marketing uh, that property as it comes available next year and, and certainly won't have a shortage of interested companies looking to occupy it. New Era, which says it began contemplating this plant shut down as far back as January, also says that it will be offering employees benefits and severance packages which go beyond what's called for in their current union contract. They are represented by the Communications Workers of America, which has yet to return our phone calls seeking comment. Reporting live in Derby, Dave McKinley, Channel 2 News.